Hi, this is Tommy Hall with MathNook.com and I'm here to show you how our elapsed time worksheet generator works and when you uh, what you're looking at right now is a free math worksheet generator screen that has a listing of all our math uh, worksheet generators. To get here from anywhere on a site you would just click the worksheet generators button as you see highlighted here. At the bottom of the page you'll notice an ad for www.edupub.com and this is our sister website that offers free math games as well as free geography, history, word, and science games and videos that you'll find very entertaining and educational. So to get to our lapse time generator you would uh, could either click on this link here or click on this picture here and I'll go ahead and click on the picture and it brings up the elapsed time generator and as you'll notice there's more ads here and I'd like to say something about the ads uh, hopefully you'll find them pertinent rather than annoying and this is a way that we uh, by having ads on our website we can keep the math games free as well as worksheet generators so when you come in here uh, you'll see up in the control panel a couple of areas and, and here you have the time interval and this allows you to set uh, the interval that are going to be on the clocks, the start time and end time. So let me go ahead and choose one hour here and let's go ahead and quiz for last time and st starting problem of 10 and I'll go ahead and click generate and it generates all my problems where it quizzes for elapsed time. If I was to choose a quiz on start time click generate and it quizzes for start time and the same for end time. Now what you don't see here is the answer sheet which is uh, which will be printed uh, which will be uh, printed off when you actually print the problems. You will get the uh, questions uh, as well as the answer sheet. Uh, if you're not happy with the uh, problems you can just gen click generate change the time you can do whatever you like it until you get the right clocks on there the clocks you're happy with. To print this you just click the print button and it'll bring up the print dialog which we, where you can choose a printer to print to or in the, this case where I have Adobe PDF installed I can actually <clears throat> print it send it to a, a file to so that I can print it later or share with others. Uh, feel free to uh, share this with others. The only thing we ask is that you include the text at the bottom compliments of www.mathdook.com and uh, that's the only thing we ask. We encourage you to share it with others. I hope you uh, like the video. Thanks for watching.